What's up, everybody? It is me, Mr. Henrik Fan, and welcome back to another video. Today's video, we're not going to be doing anything about the die casts, even though soon I'll probably make about a couple unboxings. I'm just waiting on a few things. So, hopefully, no later, probably before Christmas at latest, a couple more videos should be up. But, anyways, today we're going to be because you guys have been seeming to enjoy my first ever opinion type video at the 2020 off-season predictions at that time, a.k.a. Bell to Levine Family and then Stenhouse to, oh no, yeah, Stenhouse left Roush for Chris Buescher and then et cetera, et cetera. I'll probably give out a full thoughts on everything that happened probably before the clash next year so but anyways today we're gonna be I'm just gonna give out my thoughts on the final four and yeah so let's go ahead and go ahead and get started Alright, so let's go ahead and begin with the first series, a.k.a. the NASCAR Gander Outdoor Truck Series. So, the final four is Brett Moffitt, Stuart Friesen, Matt Crafton, and the Melon Man, Ross Chastain. So, first, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do two different picks here. And that is who I want to win and who I think is going to win. So, who I would want to win out of those four, I would want to see the most Brett Moffitt in the number 24. And the reason why is because I've been a fan of his longer than everybody else. I've been a fan of his even Slightly after his fir his first couple starts at MWR, I just thought that dude had some under was pretty underrated and underappreciated, and turns out to be that he kind of was underappreciated talent, and he finally proved everyone wrong on why he's a good driver, and I think he was honestly even back in the MWR days. Yeah, he must have not shown up consistently, but when he can. He blows, he makes my mind go, mind explosion. And really good talent. Now, I'm going to give out my four on who I want to win in order from one to four. So number one, Brett Moffitt. Number two, Ross Chastain. I mean, the dude has a crazy good personality and I respect that fully. But again, if it wasn't for Brett Moffitt, he'd be number one easy. Like, he'd pop him and Ben Rhodes would probably, if it wasn't for those two, he'd be easily number one, in my opinion. It's based off of personality alone and talent. Number three. Oh boy, I think I'm going to put a tie here. Actually, no, I'm going to give Matt Craft in the edge for third. I'm never really liked Matt Crafton, but as a late, I've been starting to gain more respect on him, more than others. And then number four, Stuart Friesen. Now, I ain't gonna deny, he, that dude has talent. And I agree with that fully. But I don't know why, but he, I just don't like the dude. He just seems like kind of arrogant more arrogant than I would like to see from somebody. I don't know if it's just me, but it's undeniable the dude's got talent, so. But, yeah. I just don't see Stuart Friesen as a guy I would personally like, but not hate. But not like, either. So, yeah, that is my... Now, let's go ahead and see who I think is gonna win. In my order. Number four... I'm going to go with Matt Crafton. He could be a big surprise. I wouldn't doubt that. Number three, 
Brett Moffitt. I hope he proves me wrong again. I hope all these guys prove me wrong here. But I'm just staying out what I, what I personally would think would happen. Number two, Stuart Friesen. I think the dude's going to give out a, a run for his money, but I just think it's going to be slightly short. But I think, in my opinion, the champion is going to be Ross Chastain and the Melon Man. It's, I'm so torn between him and, and Stuart Friesen, but I think Ross Chastain will, I think, would be my prediction if I had to. If I had to make a pick on who I would think would win, my pick would be Ross Chastain. Alright, let's go ahead and go off to the Xfinity Series. Alright, now we are off to the Xfinity Series. Your final four is... Cole Custer, Tyler Reddick, Justin Allgaier, and Christopher Bell. Again, I'll do the same exact order. I'll do who I want to win and then who I'll think will win. Man, to be honest, out of the three series, this is probably the one that is pretty close on the I, 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 I want to win. Excuse me. So, number one, Tyler Reddick. I really, really want Tyler Reddick to win this title. I would really like to see it. Because, I mean, he's a great dude, and I just think he's got the most... I feel like he's got the biggest potential to win the title. Especially when it comes down to the clutch. And I would love to see him win. And then I also would really love to see Justin Allgaier win that title. Third would probably be Cole Custer. I have none but respect for the dude. I know he kind of is, like... People would probably call him a rich kid, but I really want him because at least he has talent. And at number four, Christopher Bell. I don't, I don't really hate any of these four at all. I actually like all four of them, based off of talent and personality. I like all four of them. But I would pull, but I wouldn't complain if any of these four win the title either. But I, out of all, due to the liking the other three a little bit more than Bell, he would probably have to be four, but I wouldn't dislike him winning it either. Now, to who I think will win. Number four, Cole Custer. Again, I the, this is a really hard four through one to choose, but and this is and this is not gonna be right, so don't believe me if I say any of this. I'd be shocked if I was right on any of these, if I'm being honest. Number four is Cole Custer. Number three is going to be Christopher Bell. Number two, Tyler Reddick. And number one, I got Justin Allgaier. And the reason why I'm going with Justin Allgaier is the same exact reason why I went with Joey Logano at last year's championship. He's going to, it was the big three in a Joey Logano. But this year, it's the big three in Justin Allgaier. I hope you guys get the point there. I wouldn't be surprised at all if Justin Allgaier pulled it off. I, I really wouldn't be surprised. And honestly, I'd be happy. I'd be happy with any of these four. Because I actually don't mind any of them. I'm actually fine with whoever wins. The other two series, I kind of would have to disagree with that. But my pick on who I want to win is Tyler Reddick. But Something tells me I feel like Justin Allgaier is going to maybe pull it off at Homestead. We'll, found, we'll find out, though, on Saturday. Now, let's go off to Cup. Alright, now, let's go ahead and go off to Cup. 
You know, hold up. Let me go get it. Just get the closest ones on who I think will win. I feel like that's pretty cool. I'll do it for Cup. Alright. So, now for the Monster Energy Cup series. The final four is... Denny Hamlin, Kevin Harvick, MTJ, Martrix Jr., and Kyle Busch. Boy, what a Final Four this is. First of all, I will give out who I want to win. And my answer to you is I don't care who wins the title. I, 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but I do not care who wins. I mean, I, I mean, the, all of them are talented, don't get me wrong, but I don't really like any of them, to be honest. I don't like Harvick, I don't like Truex, I don't like Kyle Busch, actually, I despise Kyle Busch, and then I don't really care for Hamlin. It's kind of a lose, 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 lose situation for me. Now, don't get me wrong, all four of them are super talented, especially Kyle Busch. But, I don't really like them, to be honest. I mean, their personality just makes me not really like them all that much. But, if I had to pick one, my pick for who I would want, who I despise the least, that's how we'll do it. We'll go by who I despise the least. I'd gotta go with Denny Hamlin. That ain't really gonna say much though, because I don't even like him. But I despise him the least at, over MTJ and then Kyle Busch and then Harvick. Now, if I had to pick the four I dislike the least, number one would be Hamlin, two would be MTJ, three would be Harvick, and four would be Kyle Busch. Again, I don't despise any driver except for Kyle Busch. And it's not for his on-the-track actions, because I think he's an, an outstanding driver on the track, but I cannot stand him off the track. And then, who I think is going to win, it's tough. It's definitely tough between two drivers. Number four, I see it be MTJ. Three, I'd go with Kevin Harvick. And then my champion pick. I'm going to just go ahead and reveal my champion pick. I think Kyle Busch is going to win the championship. And I'm not being biased here. Because if I was being biased, I'd be like, oh yeah, Kyle Busch fourth. No. I'm not being biased here. I think if I, was, if I gave out who I think is going to win... I think Kyle Busch is that man to do it. The dude is super good, and I can't take that away from him. And I think he's got the best potential to win a championship. So yeah, let's go ahead and go with a quick recap. For trucks, I want Brett Moffitt, but I think Ross Chastain is going to win. In Xfinity, I want Tyler Reddick, but I think it's going to be Justin Allgaier. And then I want Denny Hamlin, and I'm going to pick Kyle, but I think Kyle Busch is going to win, with Hamlin becoming second. So yeah, that is my personal opinion. If you want to specify yours in the comment, you are more than welcome to. I would appreciate to see what all you've got to say, but again... This is just personally my opinion. I'm not bringing no biasy into this. I just give you who I fully think will win. Because, again, if I was biased, I would never pick Kyle Busch to win that championship. But you just can't deny some... You just can't deny talent. That That's pretty much the reason why I went with Kyle Busch. Just very talented. And something tells me he'll show up the most when it happens. So, yeah. Well, I also found this Allgaier car. I should have used it for my Xfinity pick, but it's better to put it in rather than never. So, 
Sorry for the late cameo there, old guy a car, but anyways, thank you everyone for watching this video. Make sure you leave a big thumbs up, and I'll probably go check in probably a week later. Maybe I'll make another video just to see how I did. And yeah, well, we'll see you guys next week, hopefully, if I do make a video. But I'll see you guys next time. Peace.